a very good evening the part 4 also related to that institution uh, associated with agriculture allied sector so in that uh, a uh, few institutes about uh, that national importance and uh, remaining institute and all its uh, international internationally known institutes the first one is uh, nanaji tesmuk plant genomic center so this particular center was created with the funding of national agriculture science fund and established in the ir in new delhi that the year of establishment also 11th October 2017. So this facility is the largest in India and one of the best facility in terms of analytical capabilities among the public funded institutions in the world. And uh, apart from this, uh, this also our climate controlled facilities with eight different greenhouses chamber and develop the same IRA institute with the help of that NICRA funding that is National Initiative on Climate Resilient Agriculture under that scheme they develop that climate controlled facilities also so Nanaji Deshmukh Plant Genomic Center established in IRA in the year 2017 then ICAR Central Institute for Women in Agriculture that is CIWA the year of establishment is April 1996. The present director is Dr. S.K. Srivastava, located in Purneswar, Odisha. Initially, the institute was established in the name of National Research Center for Women in Agriculture in April 1996 at Purneswar. And uh, uh, during 2014, the institute was upgraded and renamed as ICAR Central Institute for Women in Agriculture in the 12th uh, five-year plan that ICAR CAW is an institution first of its kind in India that is exclusively devoted to gender related research in agriculture that is Central Institute for Women in Agriculture CIWA headquarters is Phoneswar, Odisha then Tropical Agriculture Research in the Higher Education Center that is CATIE that uh, placed at uh, Cartago, Costa Rica. It's a regional center dedicated to research and graduate education in agriculture and the management, conservation and sustainable use of natural resources. So they are concentrating on agriculture as well as uh, natural resources related programs. So that is located at Cartago, in short call it as CATIE, Tropical Agricultural Research and Higher Education Center. International Center for Agricultural Research, CIAT, Cali and Colombia. So they are working for increasing the prosperity and improve human nutrition in the tropics through research based solution and agriculture environment. So this uh, CIAT comes under that CGIAR group of institutions. Then International Maize and Wheat Improvement Center that is CIMET, C -I -M -M -Y -T, located in Mexico City, Mexico, year of establishment is 1966. CIMET actually started as a pilot program sponsored by the Mexican government and the Rockefeller Foundation in 1940s and 50s with the aim of uh, increasing the palm productivity in Mexico. So this uh, program also headed by the Norman E. Porlak. As outcome of this particular pilot program, they developed a high yielding weed variety. The weed variety uh, improved production potential of the Mexico. Not only Mexico, the same variety helped India and Pakistan to stave up famine and produces record harvest and also that variety is responsible for that uh, green revolution so because of that green revolutions uh, through aided through this particular variety development 1970 porla got a Nobel prize so this is a thing with reference to that cement then international potato center in short call it as cip so the headquarters is in lima peru so this also a CGA, a CGIAR research group. Uh, this particular center was established in 1971. They mainly concentrating on uh, potato, sweet potato, and in roots and tubers. 
these are all the mandate club in that they are working so international potato center cip located in lima peru international food policy research institute that is ifpra so uh, placed at washington dc united states of america so that ifpra provide research based policy solution to sustainably reduce poverty and end hunger and mal malnutrition in developing countries so this also a cgiar group of institution that year of establishment is 1975 and that uh, ifpra they are operating uh, two cgiar programs like uh, policies institutions and market in short called as pim pim another one is agriculture for nutrition and health that is in short called as a for nh so these two programs they are operating then international center for agroforestry icraf uh, the, uh, the place at nairobi kenya uh, during uh, january 2019 that icraf is merged with the center for international forestry research that is cifor ICRF RAF also known as World Agroforestry. So they are mainly working for harnessing the benefits of trees for people and the environment. Then International Livestock Research Institute that is ILRA. So located at Nairobi, Kenya. So I, uh, that ILRA was established on 21st uh, September 1994. It's a non-profit livestock research organization so they made a uh, agreement among the countries like kenya ethiopia denmark sweden and the swiss confederation on the united nations environment program they may end up agreement so as outcome of that they started the ilra again that for creation of the ilra the two things they were merged like uh, ilrd and that is ILRD means that International Laboratory for Research on Animal Diseases headquarters is Nairobi that year of establishment also 1973 another one is ILCA the International Livestock Center for Africa that one also established 1974 at headquarters is Addis Ababa so these ILRAD and ILCA merged for the purpose of creation of that ILRA and then ILRA now it is placed at Nairobi, Kenya. So based on the mutual agreement between the Kenya as well as that Ethiopia. Then International Institute of Tropical Agriculture that is IITA. So that is placed at Ipada, Nigeria. IITA is award winning research for development organization R4D uh, organization. So they are providing solution to hunger, poverty and degradation of the natural resources in Africa. So R4D programs are focused in four crucial areas like biotechnology and genetic improvement, natural resource management, social science and agribusiness, plant protection and plant health. So International Institute for Institute of Tropical Agriculture, IITA, it's located in Nigeria. Center for International Forestry Research, that is CAFOR, Bogor Bharat, Indonesia. So this also a GGIR. Uh, group of institutions so they are working on uh, forest trees and agroforestry so that uh, CAFOR and world agroforestry merged first January 2019 this is a recent thing International Water Management Institute IWMI so placed at uh, Colombo Sri Lanka so that IWMI has been awarded the 2020 water award from the Prince Albert to uh, Monaco Foundation in recognition of Institute of Outstanding Research for Finding Water Solution for Sustainable Development. So initially the institute was started with the name of International Irrigation Management Institute IIMI. After that the name was uh, changed as International Water Management Institutes uh, that is IWMI with a new mandate of contribute to food security and poverty eradication by fostering the sustainable increases in productivity of water through the management of irrigation and uh, other water uses in the river basin and also the word of more crop per drop is appeared in the strategy plan prepared by the IWMI during the year 2004 to 2008 so these are the things with reference to international institute so the second and the 
ஃபிஃப்த் பார்ட் ஐ லைக் டு கிவ் யூ சம்போர் இன்டர்நேஷ்னல் இன்ஸ்டியூஷன் லெவன் டு டூ அக்ரிகல்ச்சர் தேங்க்யூ